is an overview of how the attendance is processed in web matrix. In order to get the final attendance, the system is checking the department roster and the timeline and timeline. So the roster, as prepared by the department heads or the HR or the concerned person, they will assign what is the off day of the employee for that particular week for the whole period, attendance period, and what are the present days the employee has to be, uh, has to be present. At the same time, the in and outs from the attendance machine are synchronized to our system. So all the punch in and punch out records of all the employees are transferred to our system. Okay. There are multiple combinations of the roster and the time and time out that will affect the monthly attendance processing, the final attendance. Let's take uh, scenarios as follows. Suppose the roster is assigned as present, it means the employee has to be present on that particular day. If the employee is actually present, there will be a punch in and punch out record. So, yes. In this scenario, the final attendance will be marked as present. Let's suppose consider the roster is set as present, but the employee did not punch in, did not punch out. The final attendance then will automatically be marked as absent. Suppose we consider it's an off day, in which case the employee did not punch in, did not punch out. The final attendance will be marked as off. However, in cases where the roster is set as off, but the employee punched in and punched out, so meaning it is a cancel off. The final attendance will display as OW. OW stands for off day working. In this case, the employee will get one day balance so he can take off on a different day. This procedure is done through creation of other leave type called compensatory leave. Suppose it's a public holiday the employee did not punch in, did not punch out. Final attendance will be marked as public holiday. In this scenario, please refer to the video on how to post a public holiday so that it will reflect automatically in the roster of all the employees for this particular day. Let's consider another scenario. It's a public holiday. The employee punched in and punched out. Final attendance will be marked as PW, which stands for Public Holiday Working. The same day, employee will get a balance. Please refer to the step post to payroll on how to post off day working and public holiday working balance. Let's say another scenario. The employee is uh, supposed to be present, but the employee has incomplete in and out. It could mean the employee punched in in the morning, but did not punch out in the afternoon, or the employee did not punch in in the morning and punch out in the afternoon. Final attendance will be marked as absent. There will be one step in between called verify working hours where the user can input manually the missing punch in and missing punch out. This is also the screen where to post the overtime. Please refer to the video on how to manage verify working hours screen. And lastly, if the employee is on annual leave, sick leave, or a business trip, or any type of leave, in and out record will not be there. So accordingly, the attendance will be updated as annual leave, sick leave, or whichever is applicable. 